All right. So uh, this video is going to be on that Jordan Peterson situation. They're talking about he in a rehab for whatever. It doesn't really matter to me why or why someone uh, in a rehab. I, th uh, I think the most important thing for me is that a person says, "Hey, you know what? I I, I need the, the, I, there's something I need to do." And the thing is, is that let's be fair. Let's be frank and honest. He could have lied to everyone. Especially because of all these wild leftists that are after him, that are calling him alt-right and all in the N-word, you know, the the other N-word. Um, the um, from uh, the World War days. Um, they've called him every name in the book. They've called him sexist, you know, transphobe, blah, blah, blah. And this man has been taking these shots while dealing with his wife's cancer diagnosis hey man you know what more power to that cat man it's pretty amazing that he has to deal with all that and the wild leftists don't care while they sit there and and and, and assassinate the dude's character for saying really things that that, that are not controversial that and it's such a it's such a strange space to be in things that are not controversial. He's literally saying things that any father should tell their kids. Stand up straight with your shoulders back? With your shoulders back? What? That's not, let's be honest here. It's, it's not like that's just some, um, it's not like that's just some ground, just some groundbreaking uh, uh, new new thinking. This is, this is th these are things that people should all be telling each other clean up your room and it's not and I know a lot of people say it's literally he's a, to me you're basically saying you know what's your life look like before you run out there and tell everyone that you know that this is the way the world is supposed to work and your life's a mess that's what he means or, you know something as easy as these things Take responsibility for your actions. Don't lie. Man, that's just, boy, that's, you know, and, and in my opinion, here's my opinion of that is we're in a bad place in society where the, the things that are pretty, you know, that are pretty easy are just, just completely taboo subjects for a lot of people. Something as easy as I don't think the law should dictate speech. That the law should be able to tell me what what the words I have to use. What? How is this hard? How's that hard? That's not hard. It's even as easy. Let me go on a, on a, on a little bit of a tangent. It, uh, somebody like Tim Pool being able to make. Well, I think he's doing something with Subverse, or he's trying to make. He's trying to put basically boots on the ground doing. Um, everyday news and stuff like that actually trying to report facts it's amazing that we're at a point in society that the niche market or a, a, a niche market a a market that you can make a lot of money in possibly is just reporting the news with no opinion that, that what that's just the facts let's just stick to the facts on exactly what's going on not your opinion what's going on why is that so outlandish to a lot of these people? Just, just you know, telling the truth, being real with yourself, making good decisions, not having the government tell you things that you have that you can and cannot say. These are not hard things. There's no, there's no real way to spin that. And so with Jordan Peterson, hey man, like I said before, more power to this guy, because this guy's actually dealing with all that while dealing with wild le uh, uh, leftists trying to drag him through the mud for and say things or attribute things to him that, that, are, that are not even true. Absolutely amazing. And having to deal with all that, hell, he could have just said, F everyone, I, I, I got stuff to deal with here. And, and look what he did. He was like, hey, I'm going to still... And, and I know a lot of people, um, uh, a lot of his people, like, you know, father, fatherless people and, and 
things like that. They say the things that that's what the father would say. That's really things that a father would do. Even if he's dealing with this and that at work, this and that, he's, he comes back and still can give a child valuable information. He can still do that. Yeah, I think that's quite amazing. Anyway, that's my thoughts on that. Comment, like, share, subscribe, and see you next time.